Hello and welcome back my fellow mages and mystics. And today, what we're going to do, we're going to do something a little bit different. I have been working on this kitchen. I've got it all dug out. And it's going to go up one more layer, I think, just for my own sake. And I've got it dug out all the way over here to this hallway. And yeah, this is going to be pretty nice. There's going to be more going on in here than just kitchen. I plan on putting a wall somewhere here, separate this back stuff so I can have some botany pots growing a few different things. And today, ah, let's set this up first real quick. And it's going into my backpack. All right. And I need one more piece of stone. I can never get just one. And it's going into my backpack. Alright, I'm going to shut that off. That can go back there. That can go there. I'm going to make an infinite water source here. Oh, crap. Because <clears throat> I want to see if a couple things will grow. And I am super fast. Let me see. Okay, that's better. I like being that fast, <clears throat> but then when I'm trying to do stuff like this, I don't. So I think I can put water in here. Place the seed to start growing. Okay. Now I think if I put this in here, is the rice going to grow? It looks like it might be. <clears throat> yeah, it's growing. And I want to see if this will grow in here. Oh, no, man. That is that sucks. Because this is water lettuce. And it comes from the baby fat mod. Which... I don't know why they picked that name for the mod, but it adds goldfish. And I traveled 10,000 blocks or more for this stuff. And it is not easy <laughs> to find in this pack. So, but what I think I'm going to do is I'm going to take that out. And I've got wrong chest rich soil and what is something that I want <clears throat> to grow in there hmm will cocoa beans grow I don't think it will, but I will try it, and if not, I'm going to grab just a wheat seed. So I can put that in. Yeah, I didn't think cocoa beans would grow in there, but I'll put wheat in. And I want to start growing rice. Because I can make rice bales. Or that. I can use it to compost. Or I can cut it to get this straw. To get this organic compost. And that's what I <clears throat> want to get. For decorative reasons. And that will unlock a whole bunch of stuff. And wheat, we'll just get that growing, just because it'll be good. So, now, I'm going to put that in there, which quit. I'll put that in there, because I went out and I got a bunch of these goldfish. I'm going to take two, I'm going to take one of these, and I need 
another bucket of water which is why I made this because I want to start getting into doing something here Right, because I want to get these guys going. They need to be by. They need to be near this. So if I put that down, oh wow, it went already. That's awesome. You can get different varieties of these. And that's what I want. I want to make an aquarium. I'm not sure. Oh, excuse me. I'm not sure where I want my aquarium yet. But I'm going to want to get these guys going. So we did that. That was easier than I thought. So I thought I was going to have to spend more time on that. We'll put our cocoa bean away. Ah, it is morning. I'll show you where I went and this trip I went up that way a couple times went way up way up there this time I went all the way around here I finally found one of the water lettuce like right in this little pond right here because I remember it was between two villages here and this village has a waystone so but yeah that's where I went I went on quite a big adventure. So if you guys want to see more adventuring, let me know in the comments. But yeah, this is awesome. I want to get these ranchu going, breeding. Breeding cooldown. Growing time. Hold still, you little bugger. Growing time, 1,094. <clears throat> yeah, so I want to get those going because I want to make a nice aquarium. And I also have to find um, a mangrove forest. So nature's compass. I can get a compass, four iron, and a piece of redstone. A piece of redstone. Four saplings and four. So. And I'm going to take all these saplings out. There we have a nature's compass. Saplings should all be in here. <clears throat> because, yeah. And eventually, when we go up top, I want to be able to have a nice orchard. And speaking of up top, above ground. Oh. That's... That's pretty cool. Huh. I knew there was a spider in here. But, yeah. I've been busy. I have now the, um, what do you call it? The gatehouse for my property built. This took me a while. I've been working at this for a minute or two. The top's not done. Just the facade there. I'm going to go back through and add cracked stone, mossy stone, and kind of rough it up like I did this path. So I think that just gives a bit more visual interest. So I haven't done any of that yet. I'm going to do the same thing for the towers. I want to put um, arrow 
uh, arrow slits in them and things like that so nature's compass let's see how far away mangrove swamp start search it is 4,000 blocks off this way and the reason why I want to do that is I believe betas spawn there that's a dungeon that's 755 away 392 home do I have that marked a waystone a cruise all right let's see how long it'll take for us to that's still 3,000 blocks away so it's off in this direction so let's put our hat back on and see if we can get off in that direction oh dang it we dropped in the water and we'll see also if we can find some other interesting stuff on the way so but yeah like I said I haven't been doing a lot of recording of this lately because I've been working on some other stuff. I'm working on a server at the moment as well. It is a non-modded server. And it will be open. So if you guys are interested in that, I will, when I get more, uh, more developed on the server, I, wah, whew. Hmm. Interesting. Huh. Yeah, I wasn't paying attention. Luckily, there was water there. So, but yeah, like I was saying... When I get more done on the server, more details, uh, it's early, early, early development still. I'll grab that. I know I have a couple, but having another one isn't a big deal. So, but yeah, like I said, it's early development yet. Uh, I plan to have a lot that you can do. I, I'm using data packs and plugins, and... Yeah, so there'll be no mods and all that. So, this is going to take me a while to get to where I'm going. So I will catch you guys in the next episode. Until then, stay magical. Bye-bye.